Shelly? Oh, it's you, Executor. You gave me quite a shock. What's wrong? You seem distracted. It's nothing, nothing at all. I, I'm doing well. Yes, I'm well. Oh, are you here to see Saki? Should I contact her for you right now? Stop! 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 Hmm... Something seems off. Fine, you win. Can I trust you, Executor? Of course. Then... Listen to this inhumane, thought-provoking, tear-jerking, and miserable story. <laughs> I've been so miserable lately. I thought working in the security force was tough enough, but Lynn played a cruel trick on me. This entire month, I've been going up and down, working around the clock, all day and night. I've never gotten off work before 2100. Oh. I know, right? So, it was 10.30 when I woke up this morning. Even eight alarms couldn't wake me. So... And so... I missed the limited edition figurines release at 10 o'clock. It was for Saki, right? Yes. I made her buy me three meals for that. What should I say to her if I can't get it? Your boo-hoo won't help. Oh, I know. Can I ask you a favor, Executor? Pass a message to Saki for me. Just tell her... There was an urgent mission today, and Shelly was forced to help. So, she couldn't get your figurine. That's perfect. Um, about that. It makes sense that I couldn't get the figurine because I was on an urgent mission, right? Uh, please, I'm counting on you. Uh, all right. Awesome. I knew I could count on you. I just asked the guys on duty, and they said Saki's on a mission at the Oasis Club. Go look for her there. I'm counting on you to get me through this. You got this. I'll treat you to a meal in Mirafleur Hall once it's all over. All right, all right. Just go. Gotta run. Bye! Executor, what are you doing here? Hmm, who's this, Saki? Why don't you introduce us? Oh, this is the Executor, who's something of a famous person in Meroria these days. They're helping out the security force right now. This is Dorothy, uh, some sort of friend of mine. Hey, what do you mean by some sort of? You think I'm not good enough for you? Don't forget your past as a biker. Shush. That never happened. I'm a top agent now, so watch what you say. Are you here to watch Fenrir's performance too? What do you think? Isn't it great? Hi. Actually, I'm here for Captain Sakifua. Huh? Me? What can I do for you? Shelly wanted me to pass a message on to you. She said there was an urgent mission today and Shelly was forced to help. An urgent mission? Is it serious? Should I send some people over? Uh, I think it isn't serious. 
I guess she can deal with it on her own. It's just that... The time... The time? Yes. Shelly mentioned a figurine release. And she may... What? Are you talking about my... Yeah, it's exactly what you think. My... <coughs> Saki, why do you look so pale? Saki! Uh, are you alright? I'm just... I'm just... Give me a moment. I need to calm down. Hey, Saki, you all right? Since you're from the security force, please get a few skilled guys to protect Fenrir. She doesn't look like she'll get better anymore. <coughs> hey, put yourself together, will you? Fenrir has to perform here. If you're going to die, do it somewhere else. Shut... Shut up! Take it easy. I'm trying to be caring. Okay. I I'm fine. There will be a raffle at the end of the release event. I've been praying sincerely for three days. I'm sure luck will take my side and I'll get what I want. Hey, hey! Are you planning on wasting all your money on a raffle again? Hey! Listen to me. You can't do that. Who will protect Fenrir once you're gone? Uh, I'll do it. Executor! You're really my best! My best friend! I'll include it in your mission records. Thanks! Huh? Hey, is this, uh, colleague of yours good? Trust me. Darn it, Saki. How unreliable can you get? You just ran off like that. <clears throat> uh. Forget it, you'll do. Since Saki strongly recommended you, I'm certain you're skilled enough to complete this assignment. But if you fail, <clears throat> I won't show any mercy. <laughs> you can talk the talk. All right, I believe you. Um, what's the assignment? Did you see that kid on the stage? That was Fenrir. It was under my protection. But someone had the gall to target them recently, and even sent a kidnapping threat to me. Kidnapping? Someone is planning to kidnap Fenrir? Yes. The letter was mixed in with Fenrir's usual fan mail. I can't locate its source, so we'll just have to wait for them to try something. So my job is to protect Fenrir? Where is she right now? Room 304, Star Apartments. She'll be returning there after the performance, and I've banned her from going out for now. Right, got it. Is there anything else? No. Really? Ugh, fine. Just don't tell her about the kidnapping. She's difficult to control as is, and I'm afraid it'll get worse if she finds out. Uh, and, uh, I hope that you could help me when it comes to her education. Her education? Ugh, just help me out and support me. Anyway, just don't go against me in front of Fenrir. Otherwise, things will get even more difficult for us. Phew. All right, I'll be counting on you. I'll buy you a drink once it's all over. Uh, that isn't necessary. Don't be shy. Tell Saki to come too. Just put it all on my tab. <laughs> <laughs> Dorothy, there's someone outside. Mm, I smell a stranger. What? Oh, it's fine. It's someone I called over. 
Dorothy! It's the smell of a good person! Don't get too close, Fenrir. Hello, Fenrir. Hi, hi! I just heard about you from Dorothy. I've been waiting for you. Dorothy said you'll play with me all day. Uh, wait a minute. It's true, right? You'll company Fenrir all day, right? Yeah. Yay! I have so many fan letters right now, I'm still going through them. Wanna read them with me? Okay. Read them out loud for you. Ahem. I've been in love with you for only three days of my life. Yesterday, today, and tomorrow. Hmm. Only three days. Hmm. 365, 364 is 363. Well, what about the other 363 days? That makes sense. Besides their idol, they should be spending more time with their friends and family, right? I've been with Dorothy all the time lately, too. I had tea and cake with Dorothy yesterday. The day before, Dorothy read me a fairy tale. She won't let me go out lately. I only managed to get out today because of work. Huh. I want to go out and play. I... Fenrir, these letters are scattered all over the place. How about I read them to you? Really? Yay! I get headaches from reading too much, so that's really helpful. Now I get why Dorothy wanted you to be my friend. Give me a moment, Fenrir. I have to speak with Miss Dorothy. Dorothy? Oof. I'm coming to see her, too. Wait. Dorothy! I want to go out and play! No. But... I promised my friends! No. I'll come home early. I'll be good. No! I... You're not going anywhere today. It's dangerous out there. <sighs> Fenrir. Fine. I won't go anywhere. I'm quite well behaved. Can I help you, Executor? 
I found another ransom note. What? Oh, I knew it. One note might be a coincidence, but two notes definitely point to something malicious. So what do you plan to do about it? Just keeping her cooped up won't solve anything. Wait, you think I like doing it? I'm sure you've noticed that it's impossible to tame Fenrir without being stern. Will you take responsibility if she gets kidnapped? What are you trying to say? You heard me. You're not thinking about taking Fenrir outside, are you? No, absolutely not. I won't allow it. I heard about your past. Didn't you even try to gather some information after the incident occurred? No, what? I... I'm a law-abiding citizen. Don't try to slander me. Fine. I tried, but couldn't find anything. Darn it! They're really good at hiding their tracks. If the person behind this was able to stay hidden for so long, they must know everything about Fenrir's daily life. The most terrifying enemy is the one who knows you best. With an enemy like that, we're dead for sure if we just sit on our hands. Still better than walking into a trap, right? Darn it! Ugh, it's Saki! Wait. You can do better than this if Saki has so much trust in you. You're brave enough to suggest taking Fenrir outside, so... I'm confident you can ensure her safety. People from the streets like us never doubt our friends. Since she trusts you, let me ask you one last time. Can you promise to take good care of Fenrir and keep her safe? Can I rest assured that she'll be in good hands? Contact me if anything happens. All right, off you go. Executor? Oh, Executor, will you read more letters for me? I just read about marriage. Do marriages make people happy? Fenrir, Miss Dorothy agreed to let me take you outside. Huh? Let's go out and play! Let's go play! Let's go out and play! Executor, you're the best. I'm gonna take you to my secret base. Secret base? Uh-huh. Let's go get some kitty snacks from the pet store. Then I will take you to my secret base. Let's go! We should tell Dorothy before we leave, or she'll get worried. Huh? You're going out? Take this card, just in case Fenrir wants to get something. Thanks. food in there my doggies love the jerky here I'm going to buy some toys for my doggies too I saw a list of best sellers recently there were so many of them like a remote control plane hmm food and jerky do you need anything else no I'm actually here to buy canned food in a cage but I really want to have a look at the toys too then go take a look I'll get the canned food in cage for you Really? Awesome! Wait, I have to do the math. Um, a cage should be... Thank you so much! Hi, I need a pack of canned food in a cage. Uh, what's that kid doing here again? You're doing the purchases this time? Are you a new accomplice in her kidnapping ring? Kidnapping? New accomplice? What? Didn't she tell you? Please elaborate. I don't like what she's up to, but I follow the street code, so I won't rat her out. Ask her yourself. Wait! Pay up first! Kidnapping? Accomplice? Fenrir? Fenrir! Where is she? This is bad. Ex 
Executor! Executor! You're so fast! What are you doing out here, Fenrir? I saw a kitten outside, so I came to have a look. It was such a cute kitten. Fenrir, was there anyone else out here when you came outside? Nope. Fenrir, don't run off. Uh, I'm sorry, Executor. Don't be angry. I, I shouldn't have run off. I promise to tell you next time. It's all right. Where are we going now? The supermarket. I need a long rope and a knife. Okay. Executor! Executor! I just remembered the ice cream next door is super delicious. I'll get some for you. Thank you, Fenrir. Yay! Wait for me, Executor! <sighs> I knew she would run off. I'll just tail her. She's acting a little too careless if she's really up to something. Fenrir? Executor? I just saved a kitten that was too afraid to climb down. Well done. So why haven't you climbed down yet? It's dangerous up here. It's high. I'm afraid. Fenrir? Are you afraid of heights? you go up there when it's so high up but the kitten was terrified I wanted to protect it Fenrir rice cake you're here I must be vigilant and strong for the eternal darkness kidnapping ring I must be on time executor executor look she's the friend I wanted to introduce you to you're a new member <sighs> okay, out of consideration for the Rose Pact, I mean the fact that you just helped Fenrir, the greatest kidnapper hereby approves your enlistment. Huh? Ransom note? Do you know about the ransom notes, Executor? I was planning on giving you a huge surprise! Ooh-hoo. <sighs> I'm not the only one who knows. Oh no. I made Dorothy so worried. Sorry. I'm so sorry. I will go apologize to Dorothy right away. I'm sorry for troubling you too, Executor. Wait. You still haven't told me what the kidnapping really means. Venrir insists that kidnapping is a substitute for purchasing. <sighs> so you can speak normally. <sighs> you wouldn't have taken Venrir if I didn't. Bad! Anyway, our group aims to give homes to stray puppies and kittens. <laughs> We're doing good deeds, so you can't call the security force on us. I was afraid that Dorothy wouldn't allow me to climb up trees and save kittens if she found out. I didn't expect it to cause so much trouble for everyone. Sorry, Rice Cake. I have to head home today. <laughs> I shouldn't have kept it a secret. Sorry! <laughs> Fenrir, don't cry. I get sad when you cry. <laughs> huh? No, wait! Stop crying, both of you. My job today is to keep Fenrir company all day. Since the kidnapping isn't an issue anymore, I'll explain everything to Dorothy on my own. You don't have to head home either. 
Fenrir. Go on and finish your work for today with rice cake. R really? Really. You're the best executor! Yay! I'm so happy! stays in one place. We may have to search you around a little. Let's split up. It'll speed things up. <sighs> I think I heard a meow. I think it came from over here. Found it. This should be it. It's walking over. Can I just... do it? <gasps> Nothing over here. Nothing here either. I found it! Where? I almost got it, but it got away. Inky lost its tail and is a little skittish toward humans. Executor, get its location for us. We'll set up the stuff we brought earlier and capture that kitten. I'll tie the rope to the cage so it'll be easier to move. Use the knife to cut off the excess rope. Then place the cat food inside the cage. The kitten will trigger the trap once it goes inside and eats it, and be caught. It's because Inky never goes for food in a cage. It's so vigilant. We've used this trick to kidnap so many kitties so far, but we've never succeeded with Inky. Hmm. If Inky refuses to walk into the cage on its own accord, then I'll make Inky enter it. What? You can do that? You're a genius! That would be great! <laughs> You're amazing. Thank you. <gasps> now I can take Inky home! <laughs> Actually, it's my birthday today, and Mommy promised that I can keep Inky if I catch it. Happy birthday! Whoa, happy birthday, Rice Cake! Awesome, I'm sure Inky will be happy with its new home! Oh, I brought you some birthday cake. Thanks for helping me. Whoa, birthday cake? Don't mind if I do. Mmm, mm, so sweet! It's chocolate! <sighs> Fenrir! Fenrir? Fenrir! Uh, what happened to me? Dorothy says you're allergic to chocolate. Rice Cake felt bad about giving you some Black Forest cake and went to get you medicine. Oh. Oh, it was chocolate! Don't worry, I love eating chocolate. It makes me very happy. Chocolate helps me see many loved ones. 
loved ones. Yes, the cool one eye, the greedy fang, flower tail who never strays far. One eye is super cool. It's the coolest doggy I've ever seen. It took me in and protected me after it found me. One eye brought me so, so much delicious food. It's very fast, too, and even rescued Fang from traffic. Fang's very nice to me, too, but Fang had been constantly eating since it gave birth to Flower Tail and the others. One day, Fang left. I promised to take good care of Flower Tail. It was Dorothy who found me in Flower Tail. Uh. But I don't want to stay separated from everyone. I want everyone to have a home. Fenrir, Inky and I are your family. We will always stay together. Listen, Inky says the same. Rice cake. Don't forget that Dorothy has always cared about you, Fenrir. Oh, right. I have Dorothy too. You played with me for so long, too, Executor. You're my good friend, too. <laughs> now that you've rested up, it's time to head home. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Fenrir, why aren't you moving? <sighs> don't tell me you don't want to head home. Huh? Where do you want to go? I want to go to Aquaria Palace. I want to go to the amusement park. I want you. You can only choose one. <sighs> Boo hoo. Then I choose Aquaria Palace. Thank <laughs> you.